Hi everyone, this is Tina H and I have a Dollar Tree haul. I know, go figure, right? <laughs> oh, it's been a week and a half here. It's been busy and this coming week is going to be really busy. And we got a winter storm coming, I guess. We're supposed to get sleet and snow and freezing rain. That's supposed to start at, I guess, 4 a.m. Sunday morning till 1 o'clock Monday afternoon. So, yeah, we uh, went to the Dollar Tree this morning, my husband and I, and it's about you know, 40 minutes away from us is where my Dollar Tree is. And it was snowing, and my husband was like, you know, if this keeps up, it's going to be a really quick trip and in and out and go home because it was getting the roads were really nasty but it was weird it was like the closer we got to the New York State border the worse it got after we got out of there like five ten minutes away from there it hardly looked like it snowed you know it was pretty decent so it was really weird and it's weird how the snow bell or the snow bands work like that but any rate we got there safely and I was able to do some shopping and my husband went to Walmart and got his things and met me at the Dollar Tree. So I found a lot of cute stuff. I found this I Love My Cat magnet, which I thought was really, really cute. And talk about my cat. <laughs> I found Gus a new collar and it has a bell on it. And the collar is green and sparkly, and I just thought it would be really cute for Christmas. Well, when I was unpacking this stuff out of the bags, he heard the bell, went crazy over the bell, and actually jumped up on the kitchen table, which he's never allowed to be on the table. And so, yeah, he was up on the table looking for his new collar. So I told Rachel, go put the collar on him so he's happy about that. So she put the collar on him <laughs> and he started going around in circles because he could hear the jingling and tingling of the bell but couldn't figure out that it was him. He thought it was a toy that was somewhere near him. So it was really funny to see. He must he must fall asleep because I, I haven't heard the bell going off or him running up and down the steps. <laughs> so it was really cute to hear. Bandit, of course, now knows exactly where Gussie is. So, I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, but Gus seems to be really happy with his new collar. <laughs> and Bandit did not get any bones today because they didn't have any. So, it's going to be a rough week without bones. Well, at least those kind of bones. I mean, he has other bones, but those are the ones that he really likes. But at any rate, I found some more diabetic quarter socks. These are, what, sir, what are you doing? Get down. No, we do not get on the table. Down. You know better. That's a no-no. Sorry about that. Bandit thought that he would get up here and, I guess, be in the video. <laughs> you need to go lay down. You know, the minute I think I have some quiet, he's worse than a kid sometimes. But like I said, these are a repurchase. These are great socks. If you're a diabetic, they are very nice. They are very sturdy socks. They do not fall apart. They're very nice and soft. I really, really like them. This is like my eighth or tenth pair. Love these socks. I found these really cute coloring, coloring sticky notes. And it was the first time that I had ever seen them. So I thought they were really cute. And there's a different kind of, different couple styles of the sticky note. I got two boxes of Colgate Total Toothpaste. I got some storage containers because I always need these for my sequins and stuff. So I got two packs. There are six in the pack. Excuse me. Okay, sorry about that interruption. 
I got some tape because I am going to need some tape to wrap these presents. And I got two packs of the, uh, tape. I, I, for some reason, I cannot find my digital thermometer. So I got another one today. I probably have five of them around the house. I just do not know where they are. So, yeah, I got another one of those. I got some contact cold and flu because Miss Rachel is sick. So, she's got a stuffy nose, runny nose, sore throat. Yeah, so I got to get her feeling better before her dance on Friday. Found some cute puzzles. This is a 300 piece. Also saw this one, thought it was really cute. With the cats, it's another 300 piece. This is the first time I ever saw this, too. It's a 2017 Adventure 12-month adult coloring calendar. And I thought it was really cute. And these are... Hopefully you can see this, because I cannot see what I'm doing. But those are all the pages. And they are very cute. I like the camper one. You make me a happy camper. Very cute. Okay, then I found some coloring books that are older. Let me tell you about this one. This one is so hard to find. I was looking for this for Corey. And, oh my goodness, it took me a while. Today I finally found another one. So I grabbed it. That was the only one I could find. But these are my favorite ones that I like to color. And I got them because I'm going to be having a giveaway. And the giveaway is going to be all about coloring. One of my favorite activities. So I got Time for Tea. And I love these cups. And there's cupcakes. And teapots. And it is just a really cute coloring book. I also got the Tasty Treats. It has all kinds of different um, food and actually there's vegetables <laughs> and snacks kind of find it funny that they have vegetables in the tasty treats but I mean I like vegetables but most people wouldn't put it in the same caliber as a cupcake but hey whatever <laughs> but anyway cute coloring book here's another one that I really like the collector's corner Just a few pages from this one. The Russian dolls, I thought those were really cute. But, got those, and I will be going on about the contest. Going on, cheapers. Going over <laughs> the contest on Monday is when we'll be talking about that. It's just going to be a short giveaway, um, a small giveaway. Um, just some fun coloring books and some coloring things that I found that I think you will really like. So that's what the giveaway is going to be. It's going to be very easy, very simple, nothing hard to do. But like I said, we'll go into more of that on Monday. I found this really cute Joy to the World Santa Claus bag. And the Dollar Tree was busy today. I think everybody and their brother was in there. I found this cute penguin bag for Rachel. It's nice and sparkly. I found this cute one. And then it has the plane in the back. And then the same with this one. I thought this was cute too. And then just a flat design. In the back very cute 
and I found these bags. These were two bags for a dollar. Cute snowman, and of course the penguins. I made some homemade fudge today, and so I got this tin to put the fudge in for a family at our church. They always request my fudge and I always tell them I'm not going to make it and I'm too tired, whatever have you, and I always give them a box because they know I'm I'm going to make it anyway. So it's kind of kind of a little surprise for them, but I think they've gotten on now over the years that I'm going to give them a box. <laughs> and uh, got this cute box for Rachel. Course penguins. What is your problem, Bandit? And I also got a lot of tissue paper. It has Mary, I don't know if you can see it embossed on the paper. I thought that was really pretty. It says Merry Christmas has snowflakes and little trees on it. If I can hold it the right way. Got this one. And then I got this one. The snowman and the plaid, the red and the green. Very cute. But that is my haul. I'm pretty sure that is everything. Yeah, that is everything. And uh, I'm so glad that you were able to join me. And I hope you stop by again. And I hope you all have a wonderful weekend. Take care. Be safe. Bye for now.